Keyboards. Key, 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 keyboards. More keyboards again. Yes, what a surprise. Who would have known? So today we'll be building this thing, which is the Venus. Other than the fact that there's something special about this, I will get into it eventually. But we also have two um, guest and guest keyboards. This unbuilt thing. It's a mammoth with a big fat knob. We, you know we love big fat knobs. Right, Banquet? Yeah, that's me. That's good. Yeah, here you go. Your the consolation prize. Your big fat knob. And we have the moon drop. Dash, which is the prototype unit that they sent to us. The special thing about these keyboards, or why we decided to feature them, is that for first, this one has that thing. It's not a knob. Not a knob! It's not a knob. Why? <laughs> it's a fingerprint scanner. When we're talking about keyboards that have all these special features, special like us, they're very special. Right, Penguin? Very special indeed. Oh god, it's a sort of keyboard. No! Not really the style of the show, but we're gonna talk about this board as well, which is the Moon Drop Dash. As reviewed before, it has, to no one's surprise, a Moon River deck. They stuck a deck in it and stuck a USB hub in it. Amazing. Penguin, since you tore one apart, please tell us about oh, it. We're gonna talk about it anyway. Yes. Okay, the Moon Drop board is a pain in the fucking ass to disassemble. There is adhesive feet locking the screws. There are no alignment pins for the bottom polycarbonate piece, and it looks clearly made by about. Do you like this keyboard? Does this come with foam? It comes with, with the tape, the foam though. Oh yeah, it's pre-tape modded, right? Let our viewers know how I feel about this board. We have complaints about this. Yeah, we I want a custom it. keyboard because we want to customize it, we want to mod it, not have it pre-modded for us and be like, yeah, you know, your keyboard's already I like, think there's a place for that. There's a place, it's like just for not enthusiasts. Not, not these. If you want to make a keyboard for enthusiasts, you know, the features. The features are nice, Why? but still it's, miss, it's missing features. It doesn't make sense. You put an audio controller here, you don't put any way to control it. Where's my deck? Where's my knob? Where's my volume slider? So would you call it a gimmick? Yes. They basically hot glued a Moon River 2 in it. Audience, I want to hear from you. Let us know. Gimmick or feature? So Francis is going to go build the board. We will see you in 20 minutes, but for you, it'll be like one second. Two days later. We're going, we're going, we're going! How's the gimmick? I don't know, I haven't tested it. I literally just built it. It's not plugged in, you fuck. There's nothing to test it on unless it's plugged in. <laughs> so we built this. It's the Venus with the fingerprint scanner and a uh, shit. Like this garbage layout. And for one you shift for no fucking reason, these things which are supposed to give you a bit of function. Well, it's meant to accommodate the yeah, this. Uh, layout up and down, I suppose. I hate the layout, but I like the idea of having at least a fingerprint scanner. It's actually quite a useful feature because Windows Hello exists. A lot of laptops already have fingerprint scanners for you to log in. Literally just tap within a second. Your so this makes sense. But as to what is a gimmick? Penguin, what is a gimmick? Having a bigger knob. Having a huge knob just adds to the aesthetics. Gimmicky or not, I don't really think so. I think it's just an op. Use it if you don't like it, don't buy it. Where I draw the line, <laughs> gimmicks, or at least, right, is that when you have keyboards that add too many, not say too many things, one of the most pointless features I think I might have mentioned before is the Satisfaction 75 with that stupid OLED screen. One, you're not going to be looking at it most of the time because you're looking at your fucking computer. I think a gimmick stops becoming a gimmick when a gimmick provides values a value to the to the owner. If you find a knob gives you value in your day-to-day, -day, then I suppose that becomes a feature. I don't find it a feature because I have my audio controls elsewhere. So to me, that's still a gimmick. The whole feature was this gimmick argument is just, it boils down to basically like what you said, whether you can use it or not. That being said, OLED screens on your keyboard don't make any fucking sense. Stop doing that. No, but it's stupid. Shut the fuck up. Okay, looking at you, Matrix Vita, Go Polar GG86, fucking Satisfaction 75. I wanna see my what was that stupid? Go, go. I mean, You're never gonna look at it. Absolute agents like Penguin here, it holds value, I said. Also, to them, it's a feature, but for normal people like us, yeah. Weebs, rise up!
Right, yes, the keyboard. It doesn't work. No, I mean troubleshooting, so troubleshooting later. Shut the fuck up, Penguin. It works with a big asterisk there. Just it works with a big asterisk. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so keyboard with fingerprint sensor. Yeah, nice, cool. cool. But some caveats, like pain in the ass to build, plus the firmware being questionable because nothing we typed actually registered properly. Keyboard with a deck. Cool, not cool. You cool. decide. <laughs> I'm asking you, you fuck. What do you think? Okay, so I'm not an audio guy. Right. So it doesn't matter for him. <laughs> do you think a keyboard with a deck is cool? Queen says he doesn't give a shit. So you heard him first. Decks are shit. Don't use decks. I think there could be a way to implement it better. Maybe you know with the features that Francis mentioned earlier in the video. As he is right now that the moon drops current iteration to us, it's more of a gimmick that it's serves very very little functionality to its end. I can see why people will want it still. I think there there can be improvements in the implementation. Definitely. Definitely. Penguin? Cool, no. not cool? Fingerprint sensor. Oh, fingerprint sensor. Uh, for my normal life, I probably would think that this would be cool. But I just can't live with just having this board. No, I mean, as the I bring, I bring the energy of how when fingerprint sensors were first introduced on the smartphones, everyone's like, oh, is it giving it doesn't work. Now every single fucking phone has one. It's a cool feature. You know what's it, not a cool feature on the smartphone? Removing the fucking headphone jack. Yeah. Stop removing my goddamn hip Add headphone jacks to keyboards instead. Shut the fuck up. That's right. Why, why bring a phone around where you can just bring your keyboard around, plug into this and use it as hell? As a deck. Fucking deck. I think as it is, aesthetically it's great. They just have to figure out the layout. True. Just okay. the layout. The layout to us, it's a mishmash of... What the fuckery. Yeah. Why? 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 Why, why guys? I do like the board. If it perhaps had a better layout and maybe a design not so centric on the foam things. I'll definitely buy it. Yeah, I think it's a pretty cool, very interesting uh, keyboard to have in your daily life, especially if you use Windows Center. Just uh, you're in, you're going to type like the billion fucking numbers. There's that one keyboard project from this guy in China. So what was it called again? Hello World. Yeah, the Hello World. Probably the most feature packed slash also the most gimmicky keyboard in the world. But at the same time, he did everything to fit his needs. Very cool shit. We plan to get one just to see like whether we can play with it or toy with it. And he made everything open source, which is great. The same can't be said about this or this, but whatever. The boot job, why did you do this? Put a fucking knob on it! No, what we're gonna see from now on, right, is it's gonna both have a fingerprint sensor and a knob. Or it's gonna be both a fingerprint sensor and a knob. On the knob. The fingerprint sensor on the knob. The knob. Fiddling it, shit. No. Yeah. No. <laughs> like, fuck. We're out. Fuck this. We have given you the idea. No. no. We're done. Fuck off. Make sure to like and subscribe.